Hi everyone, I'm Faith. Although most of my day is spent um, teaching classes and not necessarily in front of a desk, I do tend to sit at the computer a lot like most people do. And one of my favorite things to do is to take bouncing breaks. I've found that it's changed my entire work day and I get a lot more done, I feel more relaxed, and it's really helped eliminate neck and back pain. So let's do just that. I'm gonna close my computer down for just a few minutes. Um, I always keep my Bellicon right near my desk so that it's easily accessible. I'm not even gonna put on workout clothes, so these are my regular work clothes. Um, we won't even sweat, it's just a nice relax and bounce. I do have sticky socks on, um, so if you wanna use those um, so you don't slip and slide, those are always recommended. So go ahead and step on your Bellicon. Um, find a soft bend of your knees. Um, if you have music, um, or you want to listen to the music available with this workout, you certainly can. But sometimes I just even do this, these movements without sound. It just feels so nice. So we'll start standing nice and tall. We'll find our core engaged. See if you can find your tallest self. And we'll just begin to walk it out a little bit on the Bellicon. So I'm not even um, taking my feet off of the mat. They're actually just slightly lifting and lowering one heel. I'm just shifting my weight nice and gentle side to side. As you're doing this, try to pull your core Core in, nice and tight, and start to really relax the shoulders down. One of the things I always like to do when I take my breaks from work to bounce, my bouncing breaks, are a lot of posture because I just get so here, no matter how hard I try to think about upright posture, it's so difficult with that computer screen. So let's work on that with these 10 minutes of uh, movements. So we'll just let the arms swing. Make sure your knees and toes are pointing forward in nice parallel lines. Nice engaged core, nice lifted chest, open back, and just breathe. Nice deep inhale in, and a big exhale out. And again, a nice big inhale in, and big long exhale out. One more breath, big inhale in, and a nice big exhale out. You're gonna keep this walk going. We're just gonna to start to roll our shoulders out. And I always like rolling them backwards because most of us need that little opening up of the front of the chest. Relaxing them down, just nice and simple. Big, easy shoulder rolls. This is also a really nice one to do with your coworkers. I always love uh, if you happen to have two Bellicons at the office, which is a treat, to just do this with a coworker and uh, it's also a really fun way to have a meeting if you have that available to you. You actually get a lot of thinking done, which is great. Nice and relaxed. Keep this going. I'm always thinking of a little bit of core engagement and a little bit of alignment through the feet and the knees and the hips. All right, relax those arms down and just walk it out again. And even when you're trying to relax your mind, you can always just take that split second to go, are my knees and toes and hips all pointing forward like two railroad tracks, or are they starting to kind of go like this to the side? This is fine, it's not a bad movement, but it's really nice to find a little bit of alignment within your day, so I always encourage that. Relax those arms, and we'll start to take another posture exercise. This time we're gonna work our mid trap muscles, and we're gonna take our arms, reach them forward, pull back. And I'm thinking of that little tiny pinch between my shoulder blades. Again, working those posture muscles, trying to reverse some of my computer work. <sighs> always think if I can lift just a little taller, that's always nice for my spine. Nice and light. And also, I'm working on a medium bungee. I do like the softer bungees for these workplace workouts if you have them available to you. If you don't, either bungee will do fine, but for the health bounces and these soft bounces, it really feels good. Nice and big. Nice and light. Next one, we're gonna open here. So my palms are open towards you. I'm letting my arms swing a little behind me so that I can stretch out my chest. And breathe. Big exhales. posture. You really shouldn't sweat. If you start to break a sweat in your work clothes, just take the arms down and just slow it down a little bit. Nice and light. Good. Next movement, arms are going to go 
palms to the floor. We're gonna press back. Still posture here. Really cue a lot of breathing for yourself. And I can't stress enough the core pulling in towards your spine. A lot of abdominal work here. We don't have to do a million crunches to work our core. If you just think navel to spine during your workout, those abs engage. And then you're working your abs in the middle of your work day and you don't even know it. Big exhales. Good. One more, we're gonna goal post our arms and we're gonna go wide. I'm gonna change the legs up here to a bilateral bounce. So getting rid of that shift, working with both feet on the mat now. Nice tight core. Every time I open the arms, I'm thinking shoulder blades pull way down. Really nice. And you know, you don't have to go this speed. If you wanna go slower, totally fine. Nice and light. Good, reach your arms out and drop them down. Good, just bounce. Very, very light. Shoulders relaxed. Core engaged, nice little bit of glute involvement is always good. Roll those shoulders away from the ears. Lift your spine just an inch taller. Reach those arms to the side. Nice and long, start to press down on the air to the sides. And then float your feet and take some jumping jacks. Light, airy jumping jacks. This lateral plane movement where we open our legs to the side is a great one to do especially if you've been sitting at your desk for a little bit. It works your glute need, which is a great muscle to wake up. Get some of this lateral movement in during your work day, and it's really nice. Nice and light. Be aware of the toes pointing forward, the arch is lifting. I like to do this movement with my palms open. It's up to you. Good. Easy breezy. Nice and big, airy and light. Nice audible sigh is always good. Let some of that tension out. Start to drop those arms down. And then start to soften your bounce. Very slowly, you're keeping this bounce going just a little bit. And then we'll come to a pause. So find your legs parallel, a little bit apart, toes forward, arches lifted, soft bend of the knees, lift your core, roll your shoulders back, drop one ear to one shoulder, and just let this side neck open up. Nice and easy. Keep that core in. Back through center. And other ear to other shoulder. Drop that shoulder. Core in center, this time the ear with the arm, all the way to the side, arm here, this lateral bend is so good for your back if you've been sitting, and through center, and last time reaching up, big stretch, nice and broad, back through center, heel toe your legs a little wider, nice and wide, wider than the hips, take a big generous bend of your knees, engage your core, Big breath up, inhale, lift the heart, and exhale, let your arms swing down. Again, lift the chest a little bit, inhale, and exhale, nice relaxation swing. One more set, big lift up, inhale, and exhale. Really nice, you guys, that's it. Just give yourself those little few minutes during your work day. You'll be surprised even if you do it once a day. Now I feel a little more ready to work and sit back down, a little more energy. I'm gonna go make myself an espresso too, just cause why not, we have it here. Enjoy your work day, happy bouncing, and I'll see you next time.